Hey, I'm Alan Rita from Blender 3D Architect, and welcome to this tutorial about custom templates. In case you are not following the channel for a while, please subscribe so you can keep up with the tutorials. I published uh, a video a few weeks ago explaining how to use the template system of Blender. What can we do with templates? Uh, whenever you install Blender, you will see that it will come with a few uh, pre-configured templates. It's these templates here that you can start, for instance, this general, it's this default scene, it will open with this option in case you don't do anything. We have a template for 2D animation, sculpting, uh, visual effects, and video editing. But what if we are using uh, 3D printing, or in case you are uh, trying to create something for design, architecture, or anything else, can we create our own templates? Yes, but it will require you to save your Blender file, and besides saving the Blender file, you will have to locate the templates folder on your computer and on your system and uh, create a folder it will give you some trouble or it will uh, require you some time to set up everything i just found a free add-on from the blender official extensions repository it's this one right here from francesco bellini i hope i'm uh, spelling your name correctly that gives you uh, that gives us a way to manage that from the blender user interface you don't you don't need to do anything uh, it will give you a way to set up uh, new templates based on blender files which is incredible let me give you uh, an overview on how to use it first how can we install this add-on if you open the edit preferences and come here under extensions and type templates i already have that installed you will see i install button here just click this button and it will install the template let me enable the template custom templates you will see that it will give you a list here to use the te to add more templates and it will also change your defaults it will give you some more options here you can manage templates, you can add the templates from a folder. And uh, the best part is that uh, those templates, they are Blender files. So you have, if you have a Blender file uh, with a project that you already have saved, you can use it as a, uh, as a template, which is incredible. For instance, let's start a new template here using, uh, for instance, if you are trying to create something for uh, furniture design. Uh, most common units to use uh, for that is millimeters. Let me change metric, millimeters. And uh, since I'll be using a furniture design, let's create an, orto an isometric camera. Blender do not have this option to give you a way to start with an isometric camera. So I'll we'll set this to 45 degrees. This will be 45.736 in case you don't know what this number is why am i not i'm using 45.736 i will leave a, a card here on the video explaining uh, the reason i have an entire video explaining uh, why you can't use 60 degrees for this uh, x rotation this is an ortho this is an isometric camera there is just one last step, which is to change the camera type to orthographic. And this is it. This is an isometric camera. Now, how can we create a template from this? First, of course, I have to save this file. So I will have to go into File, Save As. And I will call this Furniture. ISO for isometric and MM for millimeters. I will save this file. Let's create a new file here. And since I already have my file saved, we can come here under manage templates. And I can add a new template from that uh, file. Click here under your custom templates, click on the plus button. It will add a new template. You can set a name. Furniture. Isometric. Millimeters. And we can locate our file. Click here. And this is my file. Select it. And we now have a new template. 
let me close this and we can check here in the file new you can see that we have a new template if i select this option it will start from that file look how easy it is to create new templates using this add-on and uh, the best part is that uh, if you have a folder with lots of different projects lots of different settings for different blender files you can add multiple templates from a folder you can export them you can import them this add-on here it's uh, incredible in case you are uh, using blender to develop a uh, project uh, in many with many different types of settings and uh, assets you can create different templates for each one of your projects and this is it this is what this was a quick tutorial about how to use this uh, custom templates add-on and uh, in case you are, uh, in case you found this tutorial useful, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any future tutorials. And don't forget to check my latest workshop, Precise Modeling for Architecture, Engineering, and 3D Printing uh, using Blender 4.2. Links in the description. See you next time. Bye.